Due to the nature of the challenging operating environment, floating hoses are subject to damages caused by marine growth, seawater, weathering, impact from boat holes and propellers. All parts of floating hoses get impacted, external rubber, internal lining, and flanges. In the next couple of minutes, we'll demonstrate how to install a new full-face rubber flange gasket using Belzona 2111, a flexible abrasion-resistant polyurethane elastomer. First, prepare the surface by removing the damaged parts of the existing gasket, marine growth, and any loose parts, utilizing handheld tools. Abrade the sound surface of the existing gasket. Use 3 quarter inch plywood sheets to create a former. Cut the mold at least 2 inches larger than the inner and outer diameter of the flange face. Use the cut-out wooden former to measure and create a gasket out of a rubber sheet. Abrade the surface of the rubber gasket to ensure an optimal product bond. Before the product application, abrasive blast the surface of the flange face to achieve a near white metal finish. For this repair, we used glass media to reach the desired result. Once the surface is fully prepared, prime it with Belzona 2911 conditioner. Use a short bristled brush to work the material well into the roughened surface. The surface of the rubber gasket needs to be conditioned as well. Thoroughly mix the base and solidifier of Belzona 2111. Apply the mixed material to the flange face surface and the rubber gasket surface. Push the material well into the roughened profile to ensure an optimal bond with the surface. Immediately place the wetted side of the rubber gasket onto the wetted side of the flange face. Place the wooden former over the rubber gasket and secure it in place using clamps. Allow the Belzona material to cure fully. Remove the clamps and the wooden mold. Remove the excess rubber material following the contour of the inner and outer diameters of the flange face. Cut out the rubber covering the stud holes. The installation of a new gasket with Belzona 2111 is now complete.